video on how to put air in a tire. When I look at a tire, I generally look at it before I decide if it needs air or not. And you can, and you, if you look at a tire, and you look at this part of the tire down here, if it looks like it's 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 coming out a little bit, or if it's uh, if it's a little bit sticking out, protruding protruding a little bit, there's a good chance that your tire could be low. Sometimes I just I just kind of do like that to kind of see if the tire is low. But if you if it looks like there's a lot protruding down here and it looks like it's kind of sagging down, there's a good chance that your tire is low. You can read on the side of the sidewall real close, small air, uh, but how much air pressure should be in each tire. Generally, it's around 35 to 45 pounds, depending on the kind of uh, tire that you have. But if you have to add air, air to the tire, you want to go someplace with a machine like this. Uh, there's a lot of free air, so sometimes you have to pay for it, sometimes you don't. Obviously, you know, if you don't have to pay for it, it's, it's a better deal. So you want to get one of these, and this fits over the valve stem of your tire. You, you put this over the end of the valve stem, and then you have to force it on there because there's pressure, there's air pressure in the tire, maybe 40, 35, 40 pounds worth of air pressure. So it, when you put it on, you take off the cap, and when you put it on, you have to use some, you have to use, it's two hand, it's two, you have to use two hands to do it. You have to force it on, and then you have to hold it. And then you operate the air with this, with this, with this other thumb right here. And this will tell you how much air is in the tire. There's a little gauge on here. It's hard to read, and sometimes you have to look at it really closely. It goes by increments of 10, 10, 20, 30, 40. So when you put this on, this will pop up, and like in this particular case, there's 30 pounds. So there's 30 pounds of pressure, and that's probably a little bit low, so I'm gonna go ahead and add some, some air. But the real tricky part of this is when you put this over the end of this, this, uh, this, um, copper looking piece you have to use some force to hold it on there you can't just put it on like this because the air will leak out so you have to really hold it on there tightly and then push extra hard and then sometimes you have to kind of wiggle this around manipulate it just a little bit so that no air escapes that's that's the hard part about this making sure no air escapes when you're putting air in your tire so I'm gonna go ahead and hit the button make sure there's air coming out of here Put this over and then press down on this little silver handle and fill it up with air. Right now I'm about 30, 35 pounds. I'm going to put it up at about 36 pounds. Pull it off, cap back on, screw it on. Pretty solid, and you're back on the road. Thanks for watching.